Eronge Adventist Primary School is located in Nyamira County facing Bomet County but it is in Nyanso region. Eronge serves kids from all over the surrounding counties like Kisi, Kericho, Narok, Migori, Homabay, Kisumu, and Nakuru. Its tentacles can be felt all the way to Nairobi County. Every Monday, they start with assembly where they sing the national anthem and the school anthem and also recite the school motto. The school has a student population of 1,300 kids. But when it was established in 1984, it started with 32 pupils. The school assists the community in the transportation of the ECD kids from homes to school, the homes that surround the school and the nearby villages and markets. The principal, Mr. Keva Buana, has seen the school record tremendous growth by initiating key infrastructural developments alongside quality learning and co-curricular programs. We have constructed a dome which has been sterile for over a period of time. Uh, right now, it is on its final stage, which will accommodate 424 pupils. We have done landscaping. Uh, in the near future, our children will be having several playgrounds where they will be enjoying physical activities. Renovation of our teachers' staff. Uh, we have given it a new facelift. And above all, we were able to buy a new generator, uh, a changeover generator, which costed us 1.6 million at the beginning of this year. And we have a new pump set for pumping water for the usage uh, for the school. We have mounted several security measures for our learners uh, and for the entire compound. We have bought several gadgets, that is fire extinguishers, which have been mounted in various points. We have CCTV. Uh, you can see one in my office here, behind, right behind me here, which I'm using to monitor the entire school. And uh, we have strong fence where, where we have two main gates into the compound. He particularly recognizes the role played by teachers who settle at nothing but the best quality over the years of their service at the school. Inside your body, there is a pump-like structure called heart. the heart. He thanks his dedicated teaching and supporting staff for exhibiting utmost sacrifice to the best interest of the learners. This is what the deputy principal had to say. 
Our school is among the best in the county because of discipline. Uh, because of this, we have embraced discipline, performance so well. Therefore, we can say in the case of discipline, I don't work alone. I work in conjunction with the staff members and the head, of, the head of the institution. Actually, I cannot forget to appreciate the head teacher or the principal of the school of his efficient leadership in the institution. He has made it easy for us to work without any problem. The teachers have different approaches in their different areas and different departments to promote the learning of the school activities. Hereby, we look at each department. My name is Geoffrey Nyamima. I'm the chairperson of examinations of our school. Before the children come to school, we have an interview where we select the candidates who come to our school. And it's a competition. The numbers are many. So we subject them to an interview where they are exposed to the questions they do and we mark and we give them according to order of merit. The Department of Tuition and Academic Management belongs to I am Mr. William Kate as a senior teacher. Uh, we are trying our best to see that uh, we support the administration to move to greater heights on Sunday. I uh, want to take this opportunity to thank uh, members of staff who really cooperate with the, the management all around. The Department of Science belongs to. My name is uh, Mr. Barnabas Oyugi, the science head department. Science in this school does very well, even in KCPE. Science in this school was the best in Yamira County. The Department of Languages belongs to. My name uh, is Mrs. Mungare Jemaima and uh, I'm the head department of English in our school here on the body, primary school. English, all the years down the lane, has been uh, the backbone of the school. It is a subject that is uh, normally well done year in, year out. It excels every KCP exam. Kiswahili belongs to. My name is George Maman. And out of the five streams, I matched the reading among the five streams. What made me to read is a discipline and hard work, uh, which made us to match as the winning stream. We realize that there is good provision of water points for the use by the learners to wash their hands. The boys and girls have separate pollution entities because of their privacy. And workers who are employed in this school ensure that they have clean environment. for the kids who are served properly in the dining hall and in all other areas. The school offers food which is kept in a very neat environment. It is good to note that the principal has also given freedom of welfare associations both to the teachers and to the workers. Actually, the teachers, most of them, almost all, apart from those who have just been employed, belong to the union of NAT. My name is Olise uh, Omenga Mumanyi, in charge of uh, teacher NAT welfare in this school. Uh, this school has 30 teacher service commission employed teacher, and the out of the 30 members, with an exception, the one who was recruited recently, 
the rest are uh, NAT members. The principal has empowered ICT center and has a failed ICT infrastructure where students learn about electronic information and computers. It is a very good information management system. The principal thanks the community for offering land to develop the school. We really thank for those who came with this idea of setting this parcel of land aside for this institution, which have produced several people who are very prominent. If I can even cite of uh, Joshua Igara, who is the CEO of uh, Kenya Commercial Bank. We have the Minister for Eric in Mira County. Those are some of the prominent people this school has produced. This can be realized by their giving back to the community through supporting the orphanage around the school and constructing a dam that serves both the school and the community. This sharing promotes cohesion and integration in this environment, which adapts very well for the learners. It's appreciating what the school has been doing, because any time that he needs assistance, he comes to us, and through the organization of our head teacher, we have been assisting him to get medication, and he's praying for you to continue being there, and he's wishing you all the best in whatever that you are doing. The Board of Management has assisted tremendously, especially in construction. Our future plan as a board, along with the head teacher who is very supportive, is that uh, we want to build a new dorm for the boys because we are almost done with the, the girls and we also intend to build the new classes. And above all, we want to build a new administrative block uh, of which we want to say that we are set for it so that we may have it done at the right time when we have a budget purposely to ensure that the teaching and learning process in this institution is doing well. Teachers are normally conducted to have morning prayers before they start each day's activities. Everybody else has to go to this journey. Another very core department is the library where students spend most of the time. This is what the teacher in charge had to say. Okay, my name is uh, Mr. Machungo. So I'm the library teacher. Pupils come, study the book they have been told to study. And at times they come during their free time, they look at the newspapers and they get the current news as they happen in Kenya, even while they are in school. The children are always out in the fields playing and indulging in extracurricular activities. We realize that in their environment, there is the boarding master who actually makes sure that these kids sleep in a sound environment. This is what he has to say. The school has 10 dormitories for boys. Each dormitory takes 52, a total of 520 pupils. People sleep singly, that is, 
and people by bed, they don't share. This is one of the dormitories where people sleep, the standard form. They have named the state house. If you look at it, it is well arranged. It's having tiles. That is where they have given their name, state house. Others are the same. So they have been given different names according to the way they appear and the way they are uh, uh, men. I'm Alexina Orima, a uh, coding mistress <coughs> in charge of girls. Uh, our girls are well disciplined, uh, they keep time very well, and uh, in terms of cleanliness, they observe that. Like now, we are in uh, the dormitory of uh, class 8, uh, it is uh, divided into cubicles. Right now, we are standing in the cubicle 4. These girls, they are outstanding in the way they spread their beds and even the way they arrange their boxes. They do it very well. Uh, they don't need any supervision. They are self-driven. The man in charge of finances of the school is a core factor in running this institution. This is what he told us. The institution is a non-profit making organization. And here we don't make profits. What we normally do when we've uh, spent and we've, uh, at the end of the year, we found that there is uh, a certain amount remaining, we call it a surplus. So this surplus, uh, I can say that uh, for the recent two or three years ago, we've had a surplus that has really enabled us to do the much uh, renovations and the constructions that you are seeing around the school compound. I would like to thank our principal, Mr. Kefabuan, because he has given us the enabling environment for us to work smoothly. All in all, this is an environment that is so good and stable for learners who are young. They have a special touch between teachers, the staff, and the children. 